Well then. Oh, also. Oh, she's not there anymore. Oh no. And she's just gone. Do 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 do. Oh, I'm guessing he's probably up here. just don't have the manpower. <sighs> Refugees from every corner of the Deerwood. The dozens getting them all riled up about animancy. At this rate, we'll need twice the soldiers to patrol Defiance Bay. Yes? Can I help you with something? Why don't you have enough soldiers? <sighs> Fleetbreaker Castle. The High Justice has summoned almost half of my novitiates and more of my justiciars to a keep on the other side of New Hailmar. It's not for me to question the High Justice's orders, but it's left us shorthanded. And mark me, we're just a couple sparks away from anarchy. <sighs> one of those times where one of my fate's uh, answers is kind of not really what I want. Um... But anyway, I can help. I know how to handle myself. I know how to handle myself. It gives you a thin smile. Always refreshing to meet someone who'd rather, and rather fix a problem than complain about it. Hmm. Uh, Forge Master Dunstan is working with an Animaster Scholar to build a uh, build what we're calling Forge Knights. Warriors that can patrol our streets without suffering fatigue, disobedience, or fear. <clears throat> Some agitator throws a rock at him. We don't have to worry about things getting out of hand. He's, con he's constructed the armor, but we need the scholar's research. Unfortunately, she hasn't been around the last few times my uh, novitiates have checked. Uh, Viana uh, lives with the rest of the uh, scriveners out in Copper Lane, but I haven't the soldier to spare at the moment. Go to the scriveners dormitory and see if you can find her. When you get the re and get the research, just bring it to Dunstanton. This is the uh, this is his area of expertise anyway. Once you've brought him the research, we can sell you any arms or armor if you have need. He forges and repairs all of our equipment. We won't find any more ca capable, uh, any more capable smith in Defiance Bay. Uh, was there anything else I can do for you? Uh, you're in charge of the knights? Here in Defiance Bay, anyhow. The High Justice is the leader of our order, but he's currently stationed at Fleetbreaker Castle. My job is to oversee our forces in Defiance Bay and to keep order in for the Duke. Oh, tell me about the knights. <clears throat> he crosses his hands behind his back. We're the only professional army in Defiance Bay or in the Deerwood, for that matter. We defended the city in Adrit's day. We've improved our training since then, but Dunriad Rowe can't certify that many of our officers come from good Deerwood in fighting stock. Now we're responsible for patrolling the city and keeping the peace. With so many refugees pouring in from the countryside, that's become more important than ever. Unfortunately, that's earned us enemies, particularly among the dozens and some of the more enterprising families in Defiance Bay. What do the dozens have against you? He snorts. <clears throat> They're demagogues. Uh... Demagogues? What? Whatever that word is. And troublemakers. They forget that Defiance Bay is one of the largest cities in the world and not some frontier outpost. Most of them are mercenaries on a good day and street thugs the rest of the time. Needless to say, they've no patience for law and order. Tell me about these enterprise, enterprising families. Uh, Stominel, namely. <clears throat> They're one of the city's oldest noble families and its largest criminal organization. Their patriarch, Gedmar, has been tr uh, trying to take advantage of the turmoil 
had to expand his operations. We've kept on top of him, and he doesn't hasn't seemed too and he hasn't been too happy about that idea. I see. Is there anything else? Oh, well, uh, that's unfortunate. I thought I was supposed to give, uh, oh. Do -do 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 -do. Hey. Strange place for a shrine to Abidon, Crucible Keep. Maybe it made more sense at some point before it gathered all that dust. But the only thing the Knights of the Crucible worship these days is the nobility. As far as I understand it. <clears throat> I knew some of the soldiers who got recruited by the knights after the war was over. And they told me and they told me some about it. And they get these young kids in there and they tell them about blacksmithing and about the revolution and about tradition. Talk mm, talk about the golem like he created the crucible of knights and his forge to go win Deerwood's independence. Then they join, and it turns out all of those knights were I ever talk about uh, and, and and it turns out any of those knights ever talks about is when are we going to get recognized as real knighthood? Hmm. When are we getting our titles and our land? Their high justice wants to be an earl, says <clears throat> and says it's Abaddon's will. He's got a castle and an army. You wonder how long he'll wait before he starts a war over it. I'm saying Abaddon told him to. It seems like some members still take their ideals seriously. You see, with the older knights, some of them, uh, they were taught differently. I feel for them, seeing all that slowly wearing away around them. But nothing to be done because the wrong people are in charge. And shame they don't have better people to leading them. I suppose that's all we can do on that end. Huh. Uh, 19 hours to go. And it felt like that definitely felt like we were doing this a little bit longer than that. <laughs> and with that comes authority and responsibility. I have to say, it's wonderful to have someone to debate with. You'd think they'd be more welcoming of it at the law college. Or we could enjoy a glass of wine and a comfortable silence. Damn. I wasn't able to get to that. Like, the, not the beginning part of it. Um. Ah, here we are. Uh, is this the armor you wanted? Audric wa uh, wavers a moment in disbelief. He looks at you, then back at the breastplate. How did you manage this? You're right about the affidative, uh, affid affid of it. Unfortunately, Penem forced me into a fight. A shame it ended like that, but he's the lying weasel who started this. You did all I asked, and you are owed much. He, he withdraws a leather coin purse from his pouch, a pocket, and hands it to you. Stop by Sonalu's shop on the other side of the hall. She sells some of the best gear in the city, and I'll see that op she opens her inventory to you. Ma thank you. What is this armor to you, anyways? Osric looks around, trying to appear casual. Ah, uh, it's nothing really, just a keepsake. 
He tries to look you in the eye, but when he does, he appears to reconsider. He sighs. It commemorates the Order of Magrin, highest order of valor, awarded to the dead and never, mm, never the living. Us Deerwoodens, real Deerwoodens, we don't have nobility or birthrights, unless you're some copper, a copper offing from a deer. All we got's, uh, all we got's the honor. Ugh, can't talk. Uh, Vidego, uh, I gotta cuss about. I'm with the wrong streamer now. I'm gonna go. Oh, I'm gonna cuss, but I'm with the wrong streamer now. <laughs> Okay, took me a second to understand that. Oh, I need some beer. Not for another hour. <laughs> but I, yeah, I can't cuss because I'm with you now. I, Johnny. <laughs> Johnny. I am. Anyways, how you doing, Vidago? How is your day gone? The Order of Magrin is, well, they don't give it out too much. Not often, you see. Mm, a member of the dozens use revolutionary ties or... Mm, a member of the dozens whose revolutionary ties are as good as he says they are. Don't know my name, dude? You're Vincent? Oh, well, hello, Vincent. I will not specify my real name. Uh, my... But we can go with Zircon. That is one of the... That's some of the few things I won't actually, like, throw out. At least not for a while. At least not for a while. Uh, so this, uh, he pauses, considering the weathered metal, a pale image of its former self, but still catching the light, is something to live up to. Got business with me? Uh, maybe more than one, by the look of you. I'll show you who's available. Oh. Oh. Yeah, thank you for understanding that. Okay, so who am I going to? I think a you for... Alright, let's... Uh, how long have you worked at the Adamant's Den? She leans on the countertop and drums her fingers. Oh, a few years. I got in the minute... I got in the minute the last merchant cleared out. She nods toward the main area, main area of the hall. They've got new expeditions venturing out every week, so this is a great place to do business. And the dozens make loyal friends and loyal customers, as so long as you stick by them. The vendor who was here before me, they ran about when he sold his best helms to a pair of crucible knights. I've been careful not to make the same mistake. Oh. How am I doing this round? Have any questions? So far, just one, and that is that would have to deal with the uh, uh, keep quests that you can assign a companion to, and that's uh, how do you uh, how does the turn mechanic or whatever uh, begin? Anyways, uh, the vendor who was here before me, okay, ran him out. Oh, well, show me your wares. See what you got. A blunderbuss. Seven to eight piercing. Fine. Pistol. So far, just a bunch of fine items. Uh, braces of all-consuming rage. Plus two might, plus one con. I, th I would definitely like those. Berserker's belt. Only be used by Barbarian. <laughs> like, apparently they are based on, like, a... Uh, their duration is based on turns. I don't, I don't quite understand that. That's it. That's... So far, that's my only question. Yeah, those are fine. If you assign a player you formerly hired to be assigned to a mission they, uh, like that, they'll be gone for a few days, uh, then come back again with great benefits. Won't tell you what to... S oh, mm, uh, with a spoil it. No, I was just curious about, like, the, the time limit. That, like, like the durations. It was saying a lot. Because its duration was, like, three turns. And I don't 
I don't specific. I don't really understand like the turn thing. That's what I don't understand. Oh, and need to be here for something else. I think. At the last. Uh, scrivener's dormitory. Where's scrivener's dormitory. They can range from uh range to mere mm, two days to several days. Okay. Okay. Okay, who am I looking for? Viana. Looking for Viana. Welcome. Uh, I'm looking for Viana. Did I hire some characters in the past? No. No, I don't. I did not hire. Yeah, I've I I have I have not hired anyone yet. I just have uh, my one extra com and companion, uh, Heligana. That's it. Mm, I like V. Uh, I like Viana. She's always talking uh, talking about metal men, which is strange since I'm pretty sure she doesn't eat snowcap. <laughs> I don't know. I don't talk about metal men either, and I don't eat snowcap. I sure you'd hire just one for the sake of having someone there at all times. Okay. Anyway, she's not here right now. I flew away to Andra's gift to meet her friend, Bess and Basia. No, Klesia? Yes, Klesia. Klesia is the friend she's gone to meet in Andra's gift. In a house, not a boat. North house, empty house. Andra's gift has a lot of boats. Okay, well. He's on something. All right, I'll think about that. But Pelic, mm, uh, you know, there's a difference between hiring them daily and having them permanently. Find uh, find a store soon and I'll instruct you through it. Okay. Uh, I'll do that here and I'll I'll probably do that here, in a, probably a little in a while. Over time, I'll want to have a few You've been on your own for hires. five years. I've had Ijima. But you can't talk to him. My standards changed around year two. <laughs> oh, you. Coco. Gift. They were planning to meet in an empty house on the northern end of the district. Okay, not that one. Don't take too much stuff. Stealing won't make you you friends in this region. Remember that. Yep. I only did uh, a couple things. One of them was to help complete the uh, uh Os Osric's quest. In Zikoa, we have a memorial for the Saints' War. They say a Rawatai artillery master contributed to the God Hammer bomb. I wondered. If of course. You want Rawatai to be a part of this history. Crow about how your people helped the Deerwood. Maybe your Ranganui lied, Amawa. On second thought, I'll ask Adair. I love some of these. I love some of those. 
Talk to everyone? Oh, uh, all right. Where are you? Oh, well. As you enter the room, you see several figures huddled together. They stand at attention, armed, but not in march and not in marched gear like the Crucible Knights. As the center of the group, one woman looms over another, holding a flail. She snarls at the cowering figure. Mm, you've got pages of research here. You expect me to believe this was and just your scratch work? No joke, lots of experience points and money to gain here. Uh, don't worry. Don't worry, I'll be get I'll be getting through. It's nothing, I promise, just my notes. You hear a painful smack as the woman backhands her captive. We know you are meeting with the Crucible Knights. You think they're the only ones with power in the city? They call us the dozens for a reason. Now I won't ask you again. Uh, ooh, at a nudge from one of her men, the woman turns and sees you watching. Her, her eyes narrow. You shouldn't be here. Leave her alone. She raises her flail and rushes at you. Well, here we go. Hi. Oh, I have no more fireballs. But this should still be fine. Hmm? Ah, worth <laughs> Skill is that paralyzed skill is nuts. Uh, what's going on? Lava. Viana's face is covered in bruises and her eyes are wide with shock and relief. I don't know who you are, but thank you. Mm, rapid, mm, rapid hitching uh, breaths puncture her words. I was sure they were going to kill me. She wipes tears from her cheek, wincing as uh, her knuckles graze, uh, grazes a broom. What just happened here? I thought I was coming here to meet my friend from the Republics. Looks like I walked into a trap. The dozens must have been watching me for a while. I've been working on a special project for the Crucible Knights, and they weren't exactly subtle about contacting me. About this project, it details uh, with a rather rare a branch of animacy. No offense, but I probably shouldn't get too specific with Commander uh, Cleaver's permission. He commissioned it, after all, and you can see the trouble a little indiscretion has gotten me into. Uh, tell me about yourself. I studied animancy in Asia, back in the Vilian Vill Republic. I came to Defiance Bay to research local advances, but instead of going to Brackenbury Sanitarium, I found a position as a scrivener at the Temple of Wael. I've had access to many rare manuscripts that most animancers never see. Of course, I've had to keep my head down. I've been careful not to let the head librarian or my colleagues know what I'm working on. Uh, door fight, door fight. <laughs> yes, door fight. Door fights are. If you, yeah, if you can just, if we can set it right, door fights. Yeah, door fights are life. Uh, let's get out of here. Uh, Commander Cleaver of the Crucible Knights is waiting on my research. Not that you mm, haven't already done a lot for me, but maybe you could take it to him. I, I had kept it with me to prevent it from falling into the wrong hands, but you can see how well that worked out. She nods at Don Dwell's corpse. She took it from me when I arrived. She takes it deep breath. Anyhow, I don't. Anyhow, don't wait on me. I I can make my own way out of here. <laughs> Will do. 
Ooh, oh, just a fine, just a fine flail. What are you? Aubrey. Plus one movement speed. Oh, excuse me. Where do you? Hmm. I'll think about that one. Everything else. Boom. All right. Of course. Well, let's get out of here now. Okay, yeah, here. Uh, remaining three turns. I, this is what I don't know. This was what this I, is what I don't quite understand. The three turns. That I don't understand. It's confusing. Like I'm not already confused. <laughs> Siblings? That's right. Between the six of us, I don't think the house has known a single day's quiet. Of course, a little chaos makes it far easier to get away with mischief. Yes, I can imagine that comes in handy. <laughs> oh, boy. Uko, or what remains of it. Do, 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 do. Mm, it's really vague. I just checked the log occasionally. Okay. Uh, all right. <clears throat> do, 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 do. And boom. Have you found the Valian? Have you found that Valian yet? Dunstan needs her research. I've got Valian's notes here. Well done. Bring them to Dunstan's. Uh, Dunstan at one. Uh, when you've finished, I may have work for you. All right. All right, so anything else in my round? Uh, boom. That's what Cleaver's been looking for anyway. If you found it, I guess I've got to start. You don't sound too happy about this. Passionate too. I'm not, and I'm surprised someone as strong-willed as you is going along with it. Uh, the catch behind it is that it takes uh, it. It is it take players away you might consider vital to your mission for a while. It, me it merely inconvenient. Why am I having trouble reading so much today, and especially with words that I've. Spoken out loud and read multiple times, especially inconvenience. I'm having so pro many problems reading today. Okay, if you have a few more hired players, they can take on tasks as they get uh, offered assignments. It's worth it to hire a few more because you get great benefits from it. Okay. You're typing like shit too? No, dude, it's just my reading. 
about 90% of your words in that entire sentence is correct. And, and rightly spelled. Anyway. Oh, crap. I made it clear to Cleaver that this is a mistake, trying to harness souls like this. It's a crime against the gods, and it's bound to earn us more trouble than it saves. But Cleaver's given me his orders, so I've got to build these things as best I can. Anyway, uh, Cleaver's told me I'm to uh, sell you any arms or armor you might want. You won't find better anywhere in Defiance Bay. I can promise you that. Now, time to see if that Valian was worth all that blood and copper. Built to last. I'll be damned. To be honest, even I wasn't expecting it to work this well. Back to it. Cleaver will want me to finish the rest of them. And it sounded like he has a job for you, too. All right, well, show me what you have to sell. The White Spire. Estoc. Inflicts disorienting for 5.05 5 seconds on hit. Grants Blizzard. Three per rest. Press the coin icon. <laughs> Nothing's happening. All right, let's see what else he's got. Hedrick's coat. Exceptional plate armor. Oh, it's just like extra damage reduction. This Hedrick's coat. Plus 30 defense against prone attacks, plus 50 defense against push attacks, plus 3 damage reduction. Freeze, exceptional, and it's exceptional. Okay. What do we got here? Forge Master's Glove? Ask the merchant if they offer mercenaries. Ah, okay. It's a volley when you ask them, uh, them questions again. Oh. I'm going too fast. <laughs> 